Hello and welcome. This is Gigi and this is a weekly tower reading for my Leos for the week starting February 1st, 2016. And if you'd like to have a tower reading from me, you can send me an email at ggleetarot at gmail.com. You can also subscribe to my channel. I would be very appreciative. You can like and share my videos with your friends and your family. And I also posted below the video where you could find me on social media. And now on to your reading, my Leos. I want you to know that before recording your reading, I meditate and ask spirit for guidance. And I also pre-shuffle the cards. Okay. So we're starting the week for you, my Leos, with the Page of Cups. Things are looking up for a lot of uh, Leos after this Mercury retrograde. Um, it's going great, actually. Okay, so Page of Cups, there's a, a brand new opportunity for you that may involve uh, love. Maybe there's a new love coming your way. Uh, or maybe you will be bringing something that you're passionate about. You will decide to, let's say, start a class you know, nail class or, you know, start a class with animals, like whatever you desire, you may decide because the page is still like this energy represent on a level, a student or very fresh, young energy. So that's why I'm giving you those example. It's a general reading, but it could be this. It could be, like I said, that you're starting, you, you, you have a new love coming your way. We'll have to see the other cards, but it's a very positive energy because it brings love and and joy happiness okay just a happy feeling okay we have in the near past position the ten of ones or the ten of rods i feel that yeah there's some people that may oppose leos in you know in in their quest of just being happy they may meet up you know some type of a position. I mean, you have Saturn, uh, you know, in your fifth house, which is your house. What Leo represents, you know, which is fun, passion, love, career, creativity, among other things. And you may meet some type of obstacles right now, okay? Um, it could be because the sun, okay, in Aquarius is opposing you. So your own son is opposing you. So you're, you know, I, I'm trying to be, you know, very clear. I hope you, I hope I'm not confusing anybody because it's a bit of astrology here. But we have the sun in Aquarius and the sun is seven houses. The, you know, um, Aquarius, sorry, is a seven house away from Leo. So it's a direct opposition. Okay, so that could be why you feel that way. We all have this energy that comes around us once a year all the time. So that could explain why, but having the page of cups is so positive. Maybe you're just, people are slowing you down. You have to give people your time and that, you know, but you, it's just simple obstacles. Okay. Here you have another gift from spirit. You have the ace of pentacles. So you see the hands coming from the sky in terms of um, your finance, because this is in your future position. Your finance are looking great. Absolutely good. And I feel that, like I said, most of you, my Leos, this will be the start of this year, 2016. will start in February for you. Um, you have an opportunity here given by, again, spirit to increase your finances, to put you in a p position where if you have any financial problems or financial difficulties, you will have a solution right here. You know, if you're, um, because you, you have also Jupiter in your second house. Even if it's not in direct motion, Jupiter is still in your second house. So finance is things that should not worry you. Okay, it's easy to say, but, you know, it's you, when you have this beneficial planet, you know, in your financial sector, you have a certain amount of protection. Okay, but here you're, you will gain something. So it could be just that. You know, some of you are getting your, uh, uh, what, what we call it at work, you know, c commission or, you know, bonus, things like that. But there's money coming in. It's, it's good money, too. 
and I hope you enjoy it. And let's see what we have for you, my uh, Leos, in the outcome position for this week. More money. So this is the seven of pentacles. Okay. I love this card because it's about, but the money you're gaining in the outcome position is the money that you'll put at work. It's a de depending of, sorry, the effort that you'll put at work. Okay, because this is a ripping what you sow card. As you see, he's working and he's already getting something. Okay, so this is good for you. I find that, you know, also this could represent people that are either um, trying to, you know, have a full time job. They may be on a, you know, temporary status for a while. And then there's a good position, there's a good chance that now you may get that full time position. Or that, you know, you may secure this contract, you know. It's in the outcome position. It may not happen this week, but it could be the next few days or a few weeks after that. But this week, you'll know what it is. You'll know that it's coming. You'll already have the confirmation that there's, you know, expansion in terms of finances coming your way. And I'm very happy for you, my Leos, because it's a great way to start the month. I'm sending you kisses. Love you, my Leo. See you next week. Bye.